just uh, a hard fought game. You know, we just got, you know, started behind the eight ball a little bit, but I'm really proud of my team, how we battled back. And these guys have shown, been showing an awful lot of heart all year long. And, you know, we had an opportunity to, to give up or, or fight back into the ball game. And we just did what we've been doing all year long. And uh, when we battled like that, and for that, I'm really proud of my team. Uh, you got to give Pepperdine credit. They they battled back when we, we got our sixth run inning there and got the lead. Uh, they came back and tied it up. So you got to give them credit for not you know hanging their head after a sixth run inning there. But I'm just proud of my team and, and uh, proud of coaching this year. Let's open up for questions. Jack, shotgun spot on D1 baseball. What did you think of uh, Zach's performance on the mound? You know, he looked like he was getting hit hard for in the first couple innings, and settled in. You left him in there. Well, you know, he's been really good for us lately, like really good, and uh, certainly a lot of experience. And he's pitched in some big games for us. And last time out, he was really good against Louisville. And um, you know, they were seeing him good early, and they got some good swings on him, um, but. Uh, he settled in after that. He started settling in a little bit, and uh, we just had trouble keeping him down. And they made some pretty good adjustments to the pitches that we were throwing, and we were pretty good against our left-handed pitchers today. And uh, but he's he's been a go-to guy for us, and and a lot of experience, a lot of good, a lot of good innings behind him. So we just had one of those days early. Tyler, is it even more heartbreaking? Considering you take in the eight to seven lead and showed all that fight, then to to give up those final three runs. You know, I think it's to me it doesn't matter. It's when it's, the season's over, no matter how you lose, it hurts every time, just as bad. And you know, I just want to say I love my teammates, I love my coaches, and I love the program. Stephen, can you kind of describe the emotions in the dugouts? You know, it's kind of flat early. You guys come back, and then for them to come back and get you. I mean, uh, they came out and punched us right in the mouth, uh, down by seven. And I think you know the attitude from there was just to put some advice together and just try to chip away. And you know, I was extremely proud of the way our lineup handled, uh, you know, our bats from then on out, and you know, was able to come back and you know put ourselves in position to win. Steven, you guys, seems like you play your best baseball when your backs are against the wall, you had the back against the wall there, you rallied again today. What's, what triggers that, that kind of performance when you guys have the back against the wall? Again, I just think it's, you know, the mentality of one pitch at a time. And uh, I think, you know, in that one inning where we scored six, you can kind of see, you know, winning every pitch and trying to build some, you know, build some momentum and get it back in our dugout. And, you know, I think uh, we did a good job of that. We just couldn't. Couldn't pull it out today. Uh, this is for Steven and Tyler. Been a lot of negative stuff out there about you guys this season, about your coach. Give you guys a chance to say what you guys feel about Coach Lake. I mean, I think I love the man first and foremost. I mean, he's taught me more than um, anybody, you know, along right there with my parents in my life. Um, he's taught me lessons that you can't, you know, it's not always all about baseball, you know. He's a great, great baseball coach, but he's taught me more about life than people think. And, you know, I think <laughs> baseball just didn't go our way this year. I mean, we played well at times. We had it. We had pieces together. We just didn't put it together all the time, and that's the key, consistency. You know, I think <laughs> if you, people talking negatively about the program is, you know, it's up to – we really don't care, honestly, because we, uh, we know the integrity of this team, the integrity of this program. And uh, we take a lot of pride in everything that we do because we're Clemson University. And uh, I love the coaching staff. I love the players. I've loved my experience so far at Clemson. You know, I, I, I've learned a lot in my three years. And I uh, just want to say thank you, honestly, to Coach, because he's taught me a lot. I mean, yeah, just to back TK on that, I mean, I came to school to play for a Hall of Fame coach. Um, and uh, that was a big factor in my decision to come to Clemson. Um, you know, just to be able to put on the jersey every single day and have him at the helm is, you know, pretty special to me. And um, you know, just being able to to come to a program like this and you know meet so many great guys and you know 
just to reiterate what TK said, I, I, you know, three years that I've had here so far have been absolutely unbelievable. Um, you know, baseball aspect of it didn't go go our way this year at times. Um, you know, but at the end of the day, you know, the, the friendships and the bonds that you create while you're while you're at school um, will definitely last a lifetime.